a lot of people use little tiny Botox needles. So maybe get 40 or 50 injections, just every little shot of platelet-rich plasma into the dermal layer. Little shot, little shot. And that little tiny bit of PRP into the dermal layer isn't doing that much. And your body only has a very small window of opportunity to capitalize on that little extra growth factor that's right there. Basically dissolves into your skin and gets sucked up into your body and gets processed. So if it's not essentially directly impacting the hair follicle or the tissue around the hair follicle, then that's kind of what you get. You might not actually be getting a large volume of platelets because they're actually coagulated inside the needle. And so when you're doing that, you need a much larger needle. And so you need a larger needle that you're definitely going to get all these platelets pushed into where you need it in the subcutaneous fat layer. So like a 22 gauge, you know, much larger needle. And so with this, you are going to get a greater amount of growth factors to the area. 